Hey guys, how's it going? The name's Luke Chris, and welcome to Once Upon a Coma, an indie horror game created by Thomas Brush, the creator of a game such as Pinstripe and a, the original Coma game, which I'm assuming... Assuming that this is based off of, or at least as a sequel of, or something akin to that. Now, this is the, this is just the demo version of it. I'm not quite sure if this is if the, if the if the full game is out yet. All I know, all I know is that I'm waking up from a coma, and that's it. Other than that, I know this is based off the original coma game, which I've yet to play. But it don't worry, it, it, that is on my list. That is on my list. Reddington Park. Well, this is a lovely neighborhood. Oh, the nice music is back. I like the nice music. The nice music makes me feel calm and safe. I'm guessing it's close to Halloween time because all the pumpkins are out. Not too sure what's going on here. All right, another locked door. Hi there, buddy. How are you doing? Locked? Okay. Are you going to talk to me? Hi there. Hey there. Who there? I'm. I. I. My name is. My name is Lulu. How are you doing? Okay. We'll talk later. Alright, at the moment, I am not exactly sure what the point of the game is. <laughs> Long time no see, Pete. It's me, John. Hi, John. What do you think about my hair? I've been growing it. Oh. Kind of like a girl. It looks great. I think it's fab. I'm going to be a girl this school year, I think. Now, as a guy who's been a girl a few times around the block in, this, in these Let's Plays, I'm not sure how that would work. Anyways, I bet the gang will be super glad you woke up. It's been weird since you fell asleep. Really? Yeah, it's spooky without the grown-ups here. Lily went looking for them, and then Ralphie barricaded the entrance to Red Fork Field behind me. Wait, the grown-ups disappeared? Yeah, Lily was freaking out because they just started disappearing. As for me, I think it's rad. You want to maybe throw in Tubular in there, too? You know, Lily, your sister, and she says she needed to... She something needed to be done. Oh, right. That's right. I have a sister. I better not play it off as I have no clue who that sister is. I better not play it off like that. But whatever. As long as I can eat ice cream and bacon for dinner every night, I couldn't give two farts where the grown-ups are. Bacon and ice cream. The sh yeah, that's some real good stuff there. All right. You know, I'm just going to go. I'm going to assume that all the doors are locked. And I can't go any further. Okay. Let's try. Maybe I can go up here. No, I can't. Oh, okay. There we go. Occam's Barberry. I want to be a barber. I love barbering. Pete, don't forget about our favorite place. Lily. Oh, so my name is Pete. Okay. Well, I kind of figured as much. I probably should have realized that earlier on. Hmm. This seems important. Yes. Okay. Kadek back. Kadek back. Remember Kadek back. All right, we seem to reach a bit of an impasse. I'm not exactly sure where to go next. Although I love the the flash animation, and this is just beautiful to look at. I mean, the swaying of the trees, everything just looks picturesque, and it's awesome. What's our favorite place? Favorite place? Maybe that's where I gotta go. If I can ever figure out where to go. All right, after some trial and error, I figured out that Z is to jump. That took me a little longer than it probably should have to figure that out. All right, so that might open up how to get over here, which is where I kind of want to go. Ha <laughs> ha! I can't believe it's actually you, Pete. Yeah, I can't really believe it either. A lot of stuff has happened. We honestly, honestly thought you'd make. Hmm. We honestly didn't think you'd make it out of your coma. I would say what coma, because I have no clue what she's talking about. It's been a while since you were awake, Pete. You really don't remember what happened? Nope. Give me details. I need the details. Well, I'm glad you're back. I do wonder though, if you still got it in you. Do I still got what in me? Man, you really forgotten everything, haven't you? We used to call you the Slice. The Slice? You had the coolest razor from your dad's barber shop. And that thing was sharp. Your sister thought you were so cool. Well, that's good to know. But where is the sister that thinks I'm so cool? She tried to be all macho and go find the grown-ups. Ever since that they went missing, she acted like she, it was a huge deal. It's not in my book. Well, at least now we know what your priorities are. And what a good chunk of other people's priorities are in this game, too. Not sure if that's a good thing. Alright, so, barbershop, I want my shears, or whatever it is. Cadet back. Okay, cadet back. Uh-huh. Well, now at least I know my father was a barber. That's something, I guess. 
Lock still. And apparently I was known as the Slice. Uh, that's, that could mean a whole slew of different things. I'm not exactly sure if that's all good or bad, but apparently it was cool to everyone else. All right, after much process of elimination, I figured out that I probably should go back home to figure out what the heck is going on. Like that, nope. There we go. Hello? All right. Oh, I can interact with this thing, whatever it is. Right there. It freaking told me what Z was. Right there! Oh. Piano time. Wait, 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 wait. Get that back! Ah! I'm a genius! Ooh, what do we have here? <gasps> Occam's razors! Now there be my razors! There we go! A straight red edge razor with an intricate black wood handle and a sharp heavy blade. It aches for a painfully close shave. Ho, ho! Look at me go! Look at me go! Look at me go! I'm a cut machine! Ha ha! Ha ha! At least now I know why people call me the slice! Look at me go! Look at me go! Look, 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 I can cut with the best of them! You know, I'm wondering, it can, it can cut apart pumpkins pretty darn well. Does that mean I can- Oh, yes! Okay, there we go! That's about what I thought. With such a razor-sharp edge, I could no doubt cut through anything. Reddington Field, okay. Pete, it's me, Bird! You woke up! Hey, what's up, Bird? Not sure exactly sure how you're talking, but I uh, company is good. I'm locked in this cage. That's what's up. You sound upset. Your little sister went to look for the grown-ups. I told her not to, but she ran to the Shillian Wood. Really? Yes, and dude, the grown-ups, they're all gone. Yeah, that, I, I kind of figured that with all the kids running around saying they, they're glad that the adults are gone. All of them just started vanishing. So listen, Pete. Your sis has been gone for a couple of weeks, and that can't be good. You might want to prepare for the worst. Prepare for nothing? I'm going to go find her! Okay, quick, get me out of this cage, and let's head to the Shillian Wood. All right. Off into the Shillian Woods I go with my razor in hand. What the f... Okay. Oh, yeah! Hey, Pete, up here, you see me? I'm tempted to say no, just how he re on just based on how he, re he reacted. It's none of your business to look at me, the mighty ninja. Gomboyusa. You don't know how amazing my swinging powers are. That might be something to look forward to. How do you swing like that? Worm buttholes? But that's neither here nor there. Worm buttholes? There's something I never thought I'd say today. I swing, swing, swing all day and hide from the spiders, you know. Sure, spiders, yeah, okay. Totally glad you understand. Most people don't understand. Hey, where have you been all summer, Pete? I've been in a coma like everyone else has known. You're funny. We all know you were just sleeping in. Doofus poopus. Damn, I'm funny. Doofus poopus. Another word I never thought I'd say today. You should go now, okay, funny friend? Watch out for the spiders. They get started getting worse when all the girls try to disappear. And he thinks there's a connection there. All right, so what do we know? We know my sister's gone. We know I've been in a week-long coma at the very least. We know that the adults have disappeared. And we know that apparently spiders... Spiders have been growing ever increasing in their number. I'm not exactly sure that's a good thing, but I know there's got to be correlation. But still, though, that kind of connection is something that's going to have to wait for the next episode. And that was Once Upon a Coma. That's a... It was a very interesting take, actually. I was not expecting it to be as in-depth as it was, granted that this is actually just the demo version of it. This actually gets me a little pumped to actually want to play the real thing when it comes out, if it ever comes out. I'm not sure if it's coming out just yet. Uh, it might be out on Steam already. I'm, I'm very much behind the times here, folks. Still, though, if you guys enjoyed the video at all, please give a like, maybe a comment, a share is good, a subscribe is so much better, though, and I'm looking forward to that. This is Luke Chris, and I'll catch you guys in the next game. See ya!